my name is Elizabeth and this is my little sister. Hi, my name is Stephanie. We are the Big Cartier Sisters. We both go to Barbara Ingram School for the Arts as violin instrumentalists in Washington County, Pagers County. I will be a senior and in two months I'm going to be 17 years old. And in the coming year I will become a sophomore and turn 15 years old. Within the past four years we have competed in the VEX Robotics competition for three years under a self-sponsor team, and are three-time VEX Maryland State participants and one-time VEX World participant. In two different competition years, our robot won the VEX Design Award, and also received second place in a Maryland County competition. My sister and I have also competed in and won the first place cash award in the very first Toy 2.0 Challenge, sponsored by Hexbugs. Out of the 10 slots available for semifinalists in that competition, three of them were our designs. This is the E-Pin, short for electronic pin. It's a wearable, interchangeable pin with movable parts that is one of the finalists in the Toy 2.0 Challenge. It's a toy for little kids for both girls and boys and appeals to their sense of fashion and love for electronics. Using an Adafruit Flora board located in here, the pin is able to flap its wings the moment the connection is made using magnets between the base and the interchangeable top. This is the electronic plant. It is an interactive toy with an LCD screen that was one of the finalists in the Toy 2.0 Challenge. It is a toy for little kids that was designed to be an interactive, friendly bot capable of playing games. Using an Arduino Uno, multiple touch sensors, and an LCD screen, the plant is capable of making faces and reacting to touches upon its petals. For example, The Music Emission on Visual Vibration, otherwise known as Meow, is a project we have been working on this past year. With the help of the Arduino 101, the Tiny Tile, and Bluetooth, we have created a prototype that responds to and represents music using RGB LED strips. The purpose of this project is to help those who are deaf and hard of hearing enjoy music through visual representation. This is our project. We have four piezo vibration sensors attached to each string on the violin. And these are hooked up to a tiny tile, which senses the intensity of vibrations that are caused when a violinist drags the bow across the four strings. The tiny tile, which controls the sensors on the violin, uses Bluetooth to connect to the Arduino 101, which is located near and controls the RGB LED strips. The tiny tile uses the latest Intel Curie contains a 6-axis gyroscope and uses a 3.7-volt, 500 milliampere battery to power it. As a side project, we have also attached a gyroscope to the frog of the bow to track the movement of the bow as it's being played. Besides these competitions, we have also participated in several maker fairs, presenting various projects that combine music with technology, which is something we share a very strong passion for. Thank you for watching our video, and we hope to see you at the 2017 World Maker Fair. Bye!